Hey, welcome to the Small Business Made Simple podcast, brought to you by socialmediaandmarketing.com.au. Being in business is never easy, but it can be simple, or at least simpler. Join me, your host Jen Donovan, every week where we focus on marketing, social media and working towards simplifying your business. You with me? Let's do this. Gonna dream it, dream it, beat the someone out there listening. Everyone's got a voice to give and it's time I heard you whistling cause there's no point at all. Oh, oh, oh. And dream and small. Hey, my fabulous listener, I know it's not Thursday, but I'm popping in over the next three weeks because I've decided I've got a lot to say. My parents always knew that I had a lot to say and apparently they were right. You see, this isn't going to be my normal long-ish episode, but a short, sharp one because I think I share so many great tips and tricks on social media that can really help you simplify your business and grow your business, but the darn algorithms keep getting in the way and I'm not sure that everyone who I would like to see them actually sees them, so I'm repurposing them into short, sharp podcast episodes like this for F138. So I'm choosing the best of my social content as voted by you, or perhaps not by you, but by the people who like and comment and follow and share my social media posts. So a podcast with the best of the best social content in them via podcasting. I'm only here for a few minutes, so let's get into it. Four steps to boost your social media. All right, step number one. Focus on creating valuable content, lead with value, and give, 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 ask. Step number two, start conversation with others and have a reach out strategy. Step number three, show up as you, yes you, and show up often. Think human to human marketing. And step four, create shareable content, the type your audience will want to share and save for later. Sometimes we hear the same things over and over again, and perhaps a little like these tips I've just mentioned, you've heard them before, but in reality, are you actually implementing them? Are you leading with value before asking for the sale, sharing your expertise freely and giving to your audience? Are you starting conversations and do you have a reach out strategy, a strategy where you don't expect everyone to come and find you, but you're actively seeking out your ideal client and your customer? Are you showing up as you? Yes, as you, your face, your voice, your personality, showing up for your audience to get to know, like, and trust you so they know who they're doing business with to learn the values of your business and to see if they align with your values. Are you creating content that your audience will not only love when they see it, but take action from it, such as saving it for later or clicking over to your website to buy whatever it is you have to sell or sharing it with their audience? And again, we all know we should be doing this stuff, but are we? If you're not doing this, even though you've heard it a hundred times before, then today this is your nudge to make small changes in your business in order to be better at social media, to use social media better to make money for your business. But that's it. See, short, sharp episodes. See you next time. I hope you enjoyed these tips and tricks around social media. And remember, my small business peeps, there's no point in dreaming small. No time like the present. Tell like you feel it, say it proud. Be true and let us see you for the star that you are. I would like to acknowledge the traditional custodians of the land, the Yorta Yorta people, on which I record this podcast and conduct my business today and pay my respects to their elders past and present. I extend this respect to the Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people here with us today as well.